I have the pleasure to teach a course in fundamentals of project management here at TU Berlin. Actually, the course is set up as a flipped classroom concept. Hence, we provide a wealth of knowledge, a universe of knowledge related to project management through videos, screencasts, voiceover PowerPoints, and there even is a textbook. Following that kind of flipped lecture concept, we have an exercise in which students practice the different tools and methods in project management. They practice these tools and methods by applying them to projects or project examples that they choose themselves. Now, this class is actually fantastic. I love to teach it. And uh, it also increases in student attendance. Actually, we are up to around 300 students each term taking this class. Now, you can imagine that comes along with some challenges. If you have 300 students and you split them up into three per group, you have 100 cases which we have to assess, which we have to give feedback to. Also, in all these groups, you have group dynamics happening. And some of these groups work well. Actually, the majority of groups work extremely well. But some groups turn out to be not well equipped and have problems and hence need to be catered to. Now, all these challenges we want to address. And we are in the fortunate situation that the Berlin Senate has given us some money to innovate on the exercise part of the flipped classroom concept in the course of fundamentals of project management. We have received money to make the structured team building process in the beginning of the course much better so that we have better working project teams. This is not only good for the course, actually students can already practice how to best build project teams. We've also got money to change the exercise format into a serious game which embeds scenarios which, and embeds an online approach to these project cases. Now this allows us to frame a closed solution space which eases the evaluation, but most importantly, actually, creates a closed space in which to learn so that we can target our learning objectives idly to the case. Hence, students get more learning out of it. And ultimately, we also got funding to integrate a peer learning format and to structure the peer learning format within this class in a much more thorough way. So it's not only the lecturers and those who give the exercise, but it's also the students who help each other in learning about fundamentals of project management. And that's actually really beneficial because knowing about project management makes you study much better and gives you skills which are of high relevance in your professional practice afterwards. So hence, enjoy it this course and come and take this course into future terms with all these innovations embedded.